the, uh, the wireless chargers out in the market today are based on an inductive technology, and it's done a great job at demonstrating the convenience of wireless power charging to customers, uh, but it does have some limitations. And those limitations include the requirement to place the receivers very precisely on the charger. It's a one-to-one -one charging system, so one charger to one receiver. Uh, and it also has limitations in the distance across which it can charge. So things like uh, accessory covers that are too thick can stop it, things from charging. So inductive charging, is, uh, it is the accepted standard today. It's what everyone is doing. But all of the standards organizations are actually investing in residence uh, research because they understand that residence brings enough advantages to the market that over time we think inductive is going to move to a resident technology. But there's a bridge there, and that's where the MT3188 comes in and provides that bridge. It's a multi-mode receiver IC, so it can charge from inductive-based solutions, it can charge from resonant-based solutions, and helps bridge that gap as we move from inductive to resonance. So to go mainstream, what we need to see in all markets is low cost, ease of use, almost thoughtless charging in this particular industry. So we're focused on bringing those features to the market with the MT3188. Again, we start with ease of use. So you have multiple devices that you're, uh, multiple charging technologies that you can receive power from, makes it easy on the consumer. They don't have to think, does this phone work with this charger? It just works. It's lower cost because Resonance gives you that one-to-many charging capability and brings the overall cost down. Uh, and again, with Resonance, we can charge at a distance. So things like accessory covers, things like embedding chargers into furniture, into car fixtures, all becomes very easy with a Resonance technology. So the MT3188 is a multi-mode receiver IC. It receives power from inductive systems. It is, receives power from resonance systems. It's very highly optimized. We've taken the full bill of materials and moved almost all of it into the uh, chip. And that allows us to give a very low footprint, low cost solution. In fact, our multi-mode resonant inductive system is on par with the same cost as inductive only systems today. So the key features of the MT3188 are first and foremost, it's multi-mode receive capability, meaning again, it can charge from both inductive and resonant systems. Uh, the second key advantage is with the resonant technology, you can put multiple devices into the charging field. Uh, so you have a one-to-many charging system. Thirdly, those charging devices can have different coil sizes embedded in them. So whether we want to be a phone with a medium-sized coil or a tablet with a large-sized coil or even a Bluetooth headset with a very small coil, we can support all of those on the same charger, uh, charging residently. So this is great for the manufacturer because today they have to worry about are we charging with PMA, are we charging with G or WPC, are we charging with A4WP? They have to take a bet. With the 3188, they don't have to place a bet. The 3188 will receive power from inductive and resonant systems across all of the standards.